expecting you. It's okay. I think that my was fine. I was a teacher. <laughs> uh, welcome, everybody. A lot of people are, are expected, but I think the heat of London has taken them and slowed them down. Uh, it is also football. But it is a very poor. Uh, but uh, Cyprus is like a football game. We don't know where we are sometimes, but I hope that then we shall score well. Mm. <laughs> um, as I said, welcome. The formal welcomes will be done by Peter and Alicia, so I address nobody specifically, but that will follow. All I want to say is a big thank you to our three guests from Cyprus, who left a nice Nicosia who has a beautiful breeze at this time of the night Absolutely. to come to this cold weather up there. Also, I really want to extend a very big uh, thank you to Mr. Stefano Stefano, who has honored us again this year and left all the problems in Cyprus with the foreign powers and worst of all, with the eternal competition and struggle. I don't wish to be in your shoes, but again, I wish you luck. Thank you. Now, I will ask Alicia to extend a welcome on behalf of the university. I don't know if I can follow that. I think that was a very good welcome. Uh, again, we just wanted to say thank you very much to our honoured guests uh, for coming here tonight. And uh, I know a lot of you made a lot of trouble to <coughs> come here, even coming from Cyprus. Um, some of our other guests for our conference tomorrow. Um, I just wants to welcome you to the University, London Metropolitan University, and specifically to the Cyprus Centre at London Metropolitan University. Uh, we've been very actively involved in promoting Cyprus and Cyprus issues since 1988, when uh, John Paralambus here uh, started the Cyprus Centre and started uh, different activities and promoting Cyprus at the university in different ways, including conferences and lectures um, and all sorts of events, including exhibitions, good, the BBC Good Food Show, all sorts of different things. So we try to be as prolific as possible uh, and promote both Cyprus and the university where we can. And I won't go to, on too much about uh, the Cyprus Centre because you have really come here to listen to Mr. Stefano uh, speak. So I'll pass you over to Peter Prashodis, who will formally uh, introduce Mr. Stefano. Thank you, Thank you very much, Alicia. Thank, Thank you, Peter. John. I, I cannot record there. Oh, I will be here. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, John and Alicia. Your Excellency, Cyprus High Commissioner, Mrs. Uh, High Commissioner, uh, my good friend uh, Stephanie, um, distinguished guests, uh, my uh, very good friend, the uh, Council General of the Republic of uh, Greece, and uh, other representatives of the Cyprus High Commission, Dr. Nikita Sarina, the Director of the Cyprus uh, Airways uh, in London. And uh, all of the other distinguished uh, guests, including Dimitri Sadio Yiru, uh, Director of the Hellenic Center, the General Sec the Secretary of Akel in Britain, um, and others, you're all very welcome. Um, I, on behalf of the uh, Federation and uh, of esteem, all of us here, uh, the first thing I, I need to do is uh, thank uh, the Studies Center and the London Metropolitan University for hosting uh, this event uh, tonight. And I have to thank Dr. Alicia Christoulou and Christoulou, I'm sorry, and uh, Professor John Karalambus, uh, a long-term collaborator uh, of mine and Epistemi as well, for making the arrangements and um, for uh, chairing uh, the meeting uh, that will take place um, I want to thank uh, Stephanos for making a special trip uh, to be here with us uh, tonight. He is extremely busy, there's a lot happening on the island as you know, and uh, he has made a special effort to be here with us, um, I'm grateful for that. He will also be here tomorrow morning uh, at the, uh, the opening session of the conference uh, that will take place at the university. Um, I've known Stephanus for a number of years now, and um, uh, I would say.
say that uh, without wishing to um, uh, embarrass him, but he's probably one of the uh, brightest stars uh, in Cyprus. You know, he really uh, does represent a new generation of politicians on the island. And uh, we're delighted that he has made this connection with uh, our community. And uh, he has been a regular visitor to London. And I'm really grateful you know, that he made the effort to step in to be here with us tonight. I extend a particularly warm welcome to our Turkish Cypriot uh, friends who are here with us uh, this evening. And I want to say to both uh, communities uh, in the United Kingdom that uh, we need to do more jointly. Uh, we need to work together uh, in this country to celebrate the values which unite us, to celebrate the values um, which unite all Cypriots uh, who want to see a free, peaceful, uh, reunited and truly independent uh, island. Uh, it isn't, of course, uh, our duty or our obligation uh, or our role to seek to negotiate the settlement uh, in relation to Cyprus in the United Kingdom. Uh, that is for the Cypriots on the island uh, to do. But I believe that we do have a very significant contribution uh, to make intellectually and otherwise. Uh, and we can contribute in what is a benign environment in this country uh, without the pressures that exist uh, on the island, particularly in the north in the occupied uh, area of Cyprus. Events such as this and the conference uh, that will take place tomorrow, uh, which allow for patient, intelligent discussion as well as by communal involvement and interaction that uh, need to multiply if we are to overcome the barriers that exist to joint thinking and joint working by the two communities, both here and on the island itself. And it is through such joint work, combined with international pressure and support, that the huge obstacle that Turkey represents to a just and lasting settlement on the island can be managed and finally overcome. I have no doubt that Stephanus will uh, give us a decisive and informative lecture, and I look forward to listening to what he has to say. I'm sure there will be an opportunity for uh, questions and answers as well. And I look forward to seeing many of you at the conference tomorrow. Thank you very much.